So guys, Genshin, as you all know, releasing Naltan, the new region, which is supposed to be a Fire Nation type of uh, region. And although I'm showing you right now the 4.7 version live stream, but we're not gonna focus on that. Right now, we're gonna focus a little bit on the new region. However, if you are interested in what's coming out in 4.7, here's just a very, very quick summary. So there will be some new characters, which will be her, her, this guy. This will be the phase one and this will be the phase two. There's also gonna be a new combat content. Yeah, like not just an event, but actual new combat content. I know, crazy, right? You will need a bunch of characters. Some of them you can borrow from your friends. Some will be given as a trial. And the things you get in there is gonna be primal gems and also buffs that you can actually take into, into the outer world, not just in the combat content itself, but actually use it in the world as well, which is pretty dope, right? It's gonna be something sil similar to Spiral Abyss, I would imagine, but like with certain characters, you know, that you cannot use anybody you want, but it kind of looks similar to Spiral Abyss. At least the way I understood, they like gonna rotate these two, like the Spiral Abyss and Imaginary the Theater, they're gonna rotate them, I think, I'm not entirely sure. They will also be upgrading the reward from Spiral Abyss to 800 Primo Gems, they're also gonna be increasing the resin to 200, the Friends Camp is gonna be increased, and some other bunch of other stuff that, you know, you can probably read somewhere else. But what I'm actually interested in is this. This is the new region they're gonna be releasing called Naltan. And just to give you some context, it's a Fire Nation type of region. And honestly, I don't know, I kind of expected it to be like dark, grimy, fiery, you know, like a very dark region or something. And um, if we start to look at the video, I mean, it kind of starts off not that. And if you notice in the outside world, it immediately doesn't look like it. You already know that it's not going to be like some dark, fiery nation, which is not what I expected, if I'm being honest. I'm not entirely sure what's happening with this guy right now. Now? Why is he traveling through the rocks? Are we gonna be able to do that somehow? No idea. Would be interesting. It almost looks like some Pokemon stuff, you know, and just, just look at this world. This is not anything I expected. Like, the reason I'm focusing on this, because all the, these other 4.7 updates, cool, cool and all, right? The combat is cool, the more Primo gems, blah, 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 yada, yada, all cool. But this is, but this is anything what I expected. This is completely different to what I expected. Just look at this. This looks so different to anything. I mean, don't get me wrong. This looks super awesome. And you could say that this almost looks a little bit closer to what I expected, but, but also not. You know, then then they show you other scenes and this is like so vibrant. This is almost like some Pokemon stuff or something, which I don't mind. Honestly, I like the fact that they took creative liberties and they went with a completely different approach and not a safe approach. Uh, whether it's gonna pay off or no, I don't know, but it looks interesting. It looks very, 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 very vibrant. Honestly, it looks like nothing like Genshin. It looks like almost a completely different game. Just look at this. I mean, this looks gorgeous, right? This looks absolutely absolutely gorgeous, but like I said, I expected like some sort of a, like a fiery, you know, almost like a fire nation. I almost like expected, you know, like something like from Avatar Last Airbender, you, you know, the fire nation in that animated show. That, that, that's kind of what I expected and this is not that. And don't get me wrong, I'm not disappointed because it looks actually pretty beautiful, um, but it almost doesn't look like Genshin. It looks like almost like a different game in a good way as well. I like the fact that they took a creative approach right they could have went with something simple safe you know just make some lava stuff and mix it with like monster or whatever and be done with it but that's not what he went with and i appreciate that i i actually like this i think this looks pretty cool i don't know guys but what do you think do you think this looks cool is th is this is the kind of region that you expected or just or just like with me just hearing all the stories from all the characters how this nation is like a so close and dangerous and whatnot and you know it's a fire nation in essence and then you see these images and it's absolutely nothing like it i don't know do, do you think this is cool do you think they went with into the right direction because like i said for me it almost looks like a different game but in a good way i don't know i, I quite like it but until it comes out of course you cannot tell whether it's gonna be good or not and as you can see we're probably gonna be able to play as like this little animals because this guy using hooks so that means that's probably gonna be us right 
which is also another thing I didn't expect. It's almost like a little Pokemon game, which is cool, don't get me wrong. I don't know. What do you guys think about this? What do you think about this region? Do you like the look of this or not? Let me know in the comments, but yeah, I like it. I do, I really do. But a long answer, we'll see how it's gonna go. But yeah, let me know in the comments. I'll see you guys next time.